Did you know you can change the Taobao app from Chinese to English very easily? But how you can do that? I'm here for the how part. So let's start. We open Taobao app. By the way, Taobao means search for treasures. Just a little funny info for you guys. You can share that with your friends or family. I don't know. You can also share this video too if your friends or family uses that. After opening Taobao app, we need to sign in. To do this, we click on the icon at the bottom right. I am not sure why, but the app is kind of slow. Maybe it's still in development process. You may have also experienced some other issues due to that. Here, you don't see the sign-in page. For security, it won't let me record, but you have to select an option for sign-in. I will continue with Google because it is very simple. This notification is like a classic user terms of condition. Click on the orange button to continue. After clicking on it, select the Google account. If you have chosen a different sign-in method, the sign-in process may be different. We logged into Taobao app. As you can see, the app is totally Chinese. To change it to English, click on the gear icon at the top right. Here, you need to watch carefully to avoid mistakes. After doing that, click on the fourth option. Now, we need to click on the first option and then click on the fifth option. Once we have done that, we click on the second option and there it is, the English option. I did choose the Singapore to demonstrate, but if your country is in the list, you can of course select it. You can also select the currency you want to select. To apply the changes, we click on confirm. I don't know why this page is opened, it shouldn't, but as I mentioned before, the app is not perfect. So this can happen for it too. As you can see, our Taobao app is English now. We have come to the end of the video. I hope this video was clear and helpful. If you think so, you can like the video and subscribe to the channel for support me. If you have problems, you can ask them in the comments below. Take care and see you in the next video.